So I'm a researcher. I've been researching other people for more than 30 years, mainly about TV, what they watch, how they watch it, that sort of thing. I never paid attention to Parkinson's disease, even when it was on TV, because really, when do you see Parkinson's on TV? It wasn't on my radar. And believe me, I have lots of things on my radar. I have phenomenology perception, I have World of Warcraft, I have gender representations on TV, am I going to shovel the snow this evening, uh, Appalachian musical culture, um, any number of things. I even won three blue ribbons at the Athens County Fair this summer for needlework, or what I like to call stabbing fabric instead of weave. I'm not looking at the camera, I'm looking at the ground. So it wasn't on my radar, Parkinson's wasn't on my radar until I got it. And I can never remember what year it was, except it was the year after the year of the mastectomy. And I got that really early, just a little bitty spot that they cut off and threw away. And that was the end of it. I was freaky. Um, there's an episode of House MD where a woman... Um, gets diagnosed with Parkinson's disease and she turns around and, sh and says to the doctor, I'd rather have cancer. And I know what she means. Not that I would say that to my friend who's dying of cancer, but... You know, I so I'm still researching other people. I'm telling their stories about living with Parkinson's disease. I'm still researching how they watch television. Basically anything with Michael J. Fox on it will do. Um, and I'm sort of relentlessly, compulsively researching myself, as most people with Parkinson's do. Continue to monitor our bodily functions, what's going on, how other people are perceiving us, are our meds right? Are we walking straight? How is our how is our brain doing, by the way? So we're researching ourselves. I'm researching myself because no one else will. We don't have the pink ribbons that breast cancer research does or the gazillion dollars that the research raises, but we have our neurologists, we have our nurse practitioners, we have our physical therapists, we have our caregivers and we have our support groups. We have each other. So Parkinson's is another tiny little thing because it's like the substantia nigra in the brain which no one has ever heard of. A little tiny place that holds all the dopamine. And what dopamine does is it's like the oil in the car. And when the dopamine is gone, it's like running out of oil in your car. So the engine seizes the fuck up, it shudders and it shakes, and it comes to a stop. So I was done with my breast. They got me some men, they fed me some babies, and it was time for them to go. So over and done with, yay! But I'm not done with my brain. Hey! Let's put our brains together to cure brain disease. I'm not done with my brain yet. I'm a researcher.